Everyone in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix the outdated client version for any version of the game. Now the current version I'm on is 1.21.51 but this method will work for all versions that release in the future. Now previously I had a Google Drive file that included the newest versions of Minecraft but I found a more efficient way of doing this that won't require me to have a Google Drive up 24-7 for everyone to use and instead you can just go to this website that I was able to find and I'll have it linked in the description below. It's called store.rg adguard.net and this is an online link generator for Microsoft Store. So you can enter the link from the Microsoft Store and you'll be able to download the versions from it. Previously, I was able to find my APPX files from other people online and I was just posting it here on my Google Drive. But this new method will basically allow anyone to download the APPX file and install the latest version of Minecraft. This works for other applications as well, but in this video, we're just going to be doing Minecraft. You want to press your Windows key and search for the Microsoft Store and open it. So you're going to want to go to your library and search for Minecraft. And since we're using the Bedrock version, we select Minecraft for Windows. You'll be brought to this page here and you want to select this share button and then copy the link. And you want to paste this link into the website that I've got linked below. And on this drop down that says RP, you want to select retail. This is basically what is released to the public. And then just hit the check mark. It will then generate a bunch of files that have recently been uploaded to the Microsoft Store. So you can't download the previous ones, but you can download the most recent one. And we're mainly focusing in on the top files here that say ARM. 64 and 86 and you'll notice on the right side that it has megabytes and kilobytes and to know which file is the correct file it will be the larger file size which is the megabytes 771 790 and 778 now it depends on your system type so you want to search about your pc you'll then be given your device specifications and then next to system type it will say the operating system of your computer and what version you need to download so if it says arm you want to download the appx file which is this one here as you can see 1.21.51 underscore arm and then appx if your system type is 64 like me you want to download the 64 version as you can see it says x64 and then at the end it says the file name extension which is appx and then obviously if your system type is 32 bit you're going to want to download the 86 one so x86 and make sure it's dot appx now since my system is 64 bit i will be downloading the 64 appx file which is 790 megabytes now clicking the actual link doesn't actually allow you to download the file you have to actually copy the link address and paste it into a new tab or you can click and drag and drag it to the top where it can redirect you and it'll start the download automatically you just want to save that to your downloads and then select save once you do save it to your downloads it should start downloading in the top right depending on what browser you're using once it fully downloads it should be in your downloads folder named microsoft.minecraft uwp with the system type which is 64 and then appx for the file name extension which is right there i should also state that this file does not allow you to play minecraft for free you do have to own minecraft before you can even use this as the appx file is only an update file and it just forces an update for the game and then you just want to double click the appx file it'll say minecraft for windows is already installed or it will say you need to update minecraft so you just want to select reinstall and since my version is already the latest version it will say that i've already installed it for this demonstration i'll just reinstall it again it will then say minecraft for windows is ready and then just select launch and you should be on the latest version of the game the current latest version is 1.21.51 and this should allow you to join your friends and other servers that were previously displaying outdated client or outdated server version if you found the video helpful don't forget to like comment subscribe it really helped the channel a lot i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching